Hi, I'm Tyshawn Rowland, author of Learning to Live Without, Evangelist, and the founder of the Blackwell Edwards Foundation. And it is my honor and privilege to share with you the verse of the day that can be found in Romans chapter 8, verse 18. For I consider that the sufferings of this present time are not worth comparing to the future glory that will be revealed to us. Penned by Apostle Paul, who's no stranger to suffering. Right out of this verse, Apostle Paul doesn't deny it. He doesn't look past it. He doesn't say what you're going through today is not suffering. For him, suffering was going to prison. For him, suffering was being bidden. For him, suffering was being persecuted. But you're not Apostle Paul. Maybe for you, your persecution, your suffering is coming from your family or your finances. Or maybe you're going through something that's so frustrating and you're looking at your life and you're wondering, why am I going through this? And you opened up your phone and you got this verse of the day on suffering. What can we learn from this verse? We can learn that we need to have a heavenly hope We need to have a heavenly perspective. Apostle Paul says, I consider this present suffering, but it's not worth comparing where we're going. In other words, he's saying what I'm going through is hard, but where I'm headed is better. I love that. And I just want to encourage you to have that perspective. What you're going through could be hard. It could be hard in your family. It could be hard in your finances. It could be hard in your life right now. But where you're headed, oh, where you're headed is far greater than any place you have been. So I want to encourage you, have that heavenly hope today. Have that heavenly perspective. Don't deny your sufferings, but keep the heavenly perspective in your mind. God bless you.